Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 17th of June 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Um, I'm a bit disappointed this morning. I was awake early hoping to catch a webinar from David Feldman uh, whose uh, YouTube channel you can li uh, see a link to somewhere on my channel. Um, he has a weekly webinar but it seems like a uh, it's not on today, which is such a shame. I've, I'm so, it's, it's become one of the highlights of my week. <laughs> I love it so much. It's really so funny. Uh, let's hope it comes back soon. Um, and good luck to him. I'm not sure he was having some technical difficulties uh, yesterday, it seemed. Um, what's going on in the world? Daniel Ellsberg has died. Well, he did make it to the age of 92, which I think is pretty good going. Um, and uh, the, he was, of course, the person who leaked the uh, Pentagon Papers um, showing that, um, well, <laughs> it was pointless trying to fight the dominoes that Americans thought they were doing. Um, it was, uh, they just weren't going to win. And uh, he leaked this stuff and of course was uh, attacked by Nixon and uh, the American establishment. Uh, of course, uh, right now, situation for Julian Assange is that he is probably going to be extradited to the US and uh, face long prison sentence. Um, even Reason being because he exposed America's war crimes of uh, with the video on WikiLeaks of um, the US shooting journalists, laughing civilians and laughing about it. And uh, so actual footage got released into the wild which america would love to keep secret and of course there's edward snowden who's gone off to live in russia because uh so hated by the american establishment after uh, revealing that america did in fact spy on does probably still in fact spy on just about everybody in the country uh certainly in terms of things like metadata and stuff like that uh revealing something that everybody had previously thought to be all oh, conspiracy theory nonsense uh, he actually kind of proved to be true so uh, of course america couldn't have that so they have uh, ousted him really well forced him into exile um never never try to uh, fight against the u.s secrets <laughs> uh, unless your name is donald trump of course then you can just take the stuff home with you shall we get on with the game of sudoku it's the guardian um expert level game today apparently Let's see how this one shapes up, shall we? We've got sevens starting. Hopefully you know how to play the game of Sudoku already. I won't need to explain that to you. So we've got sevens blocking up here and sevens blocking across here. And the seven will fit there. Like so. Uh, can we work our way anymore with the sevens? I don't think we can. So we'll leave seven and say bye-bye for now and come back later when we find a bit more information. In the meantime, we'll move on to the fives with five blocking across like this and giving us a five in this square. We have a 1 blocking across the middle here now, so that's got to give us a 1 in that square. Then we can say 1 across here and 1 down here will give us 1 in that square. Uh, 1 blocking up here and the 1 blocking across here forces 1 into either this square or this square. Whichever one it is, it will block across here. And let's extend that a bit further, that one there. And then the 1 up here, hey, you're a 1. Um, so what's missing in the middle here? We're looking for two, three, five. I see a two, I see a five. So let's see what else with the five. So we've got fives up here now. How about the twos? What do we know? Anything much? Not sure. How about the three? Are we missing another number? 
Man, what's going on with these Sudoku puzzles lately? We keep having a single missing digit at the beginning. That's, that's I think, the third puzzle in two days that's had a digit missing. Uh, okay, three is somewhere here. So this was what, two, three, five. So let's look and see uh, what goes in here. Two, three, five. So we're looking for, well, eight, obviously. So the eight blocks there, that's going to be the eight. And the other number, if that's two, three, five, is going to be six for this row. Okay, we've got the sixes blocking up like so, and a six across here. So there we go with another six. And six across here, across that way, and up here means that's a six we can place there. Now we've got the six across here, giving us six in that square and then the sixes down it looks like we're going to finish off the sixes completely i think six goes here six across here and six down here and down here gives me the final digit six there there you go that was painless wasn't it What's missing over here now? Two, three, seven. Okay, and what's missing over here? Two, three, uh, eight. Okay. And this is uh, five and four, four, five. We have one blocking across here and across here, giving us a one in that square. A bit noisy out this morning. We have ourselves a seven blocking across here and a seven up there and up there. Actually, I didn't even need that seven, did I? No, that's okay. Extra information is always welcome game of Sudoku. We have five blocking this square, five blocking this square, and five blocking this square, so we'll get ourselves a five there. Uh, we don't yet have a five in this column here. We've got five blocking those squares. Uh, so that's got to be the five. <clears throat> now our two blocks down here, so there's our two. And three is, our, there's our first three. So we don't, we feel a bit safer now. Three blocks all the way up here. We'll get our second three there. We have five and eight here. We're looking down here for a four in that case. We have four blocking across here, four down here. So four in one of these two squares blocking to the top, four up here, four across there. There's another four we can get. And we know that seven blocks here. So there's our seven. And now we can finish this row with a three. <clears throat> Uh, 
um, we need a 9 in one of these two squares for this column. We've got a blocking 9 here. Let's put the 9 there and let's come down here and finish this column with a 1. Now we have 1 and 4 blocking across here, 1 and 4 blocking down here. So we have a pair of 1 and 4 here. Um, so knowing that's 1 and 4, what else are we missing? 2, 3 and 8. So we've got the 8 blocking here and the 8 blocking here so that's an 8 to go in there if I can find it on the keyboard okay um, so these will be 2 and 3 this is going to be 2 and 3 as well um, Seven blocking down here, seven up here. There's a seven we can place. That was the final seven. Okay, and we'll be up for two, three here. So two, three like this, two, three like this, and two, three in those squares there. <laughs> um, and so this has got to be two, three, right? Ah, oh, what a nice little pattern. I like this. Okay, let's just, do you remember, I'll, I'll, I'll recap for you, right? 1 and 4 block like this, so we've got 1 and 4 in those squares, so we're left with 2, 3 here like this, right? So you agree that up here, this has to be 2 or 3 in this block here, right, to, for this column. Now we're also missing 2 and 3 in this block here, right? And we know that this is 1 and 4, so that must contain 2 or 3 also, and it can't contain 3, can it? So that's got to be our 2. That's got to be our 3, this must be our 2, and this must be our 3, and this must be our 2, and this must be our 3. I did enjoy that little flurry. Um, there's one number missing down here. Is that a 3? I do believe it is. And of course our 2 will go here now. Yeah, that was... I, I like that little flow there. Now we've also got two blocking across the top here, so we'll get ourselves two there. And we have two blocking down here and across here, so it looks like we're going to finish the twos, doesn't it? Okay, they're out of the way now. Now we have our one blocking this square here, but we need a one. This was a one and a four, if you remember, so we know that the one has to go there. The four will be in that square there. The four blocks across here, giving me the four there. Four blocking up here and across here. Here's a four, and we'll take it up to the top and get a four there to finish. Now we're looking here for a five, I think. Just can't hit the right keys on the keyboard this morning. That's a perennial problem for me. Uh, we have five blocking across here like this as well, so we'll get the five there. That's out of the way. What are we looking for up here? Is it an eight? I think it is. Then we've got the eight blocking across here, which will give us an eight in that square. Eight down here means that's an eight, and then eight's blocking like this, giving me an eight here to get rid of. Missing number up here is a nine, I think. Uh, and down here we're looking for a three and the three blocks down here there's a three and we'll finish today's expert level game with a one but i it was not difficult but i enjoyed it nevertheless see you another time bye bye